Good evening. It was to be their big day, but a Jackson couple says a church in which they were planning to wed turned them away because of race. Well, now the couple wants answers, and the church pastor is questioning the mindset of some of the members of his congregation who caused the problem in the first place. David Kenny has our top story. They had set the date, printed up, and mailed out all the invitations, but the day before wedding bells were to ring for Charles and Teandria, they say they got some bad news from the pastor. Congregation had decided that no black couple could be married at their church, and that if, they, if he went on to have to marry us, then they would vote him out and he would be put out of the church. The Wilsons were trying to get married at the predominantly white First Baptist Church of Crystal Springs, a church they attend regularly but are not members of. We couldn't have the wedding at the church. He had people in the sanctuary that was pitching a fit about us being a black couple. I mean, I didn't like it at all because I wasn't brought up to be racist. I, I was brought up in the church all my life to love and care for everybody. Church pastor Dr. Stan Weatherford says he was taken by surprise by what he calls a small minority against the black marriage at the church. This was, had, not, had never been done here before, so it was setting a new precedence. And there were those who reacted to that because of that. Weatherford went on and performed the wedding at a nearby church. But I didn't want to, to have a controversy within the church, and I certainly didn't want a controversy to affect the wedding of Charles and Teandria. I wanted to make sure that their wedding day was a special day. After months of planning, the newlyweds say they had no choice but to go through with the wedding at the new location, but they still can't understand why a church would ban their wedding because of race. I blame First Baptist Church of Crystal Springs. I blame those members who knew and called themselves being Christians and didn't stand up. Church officials say they welcome any race into their congregation. They now plan to hold internal meetings on how to move forward should this situation reoccur. I was prepared to just go ahead and do the wedding here. Just like it was planned and just like we had agreed to. I was just looking for an opportunity, an option to, to be able to address a need within our congregation and at the same time minister to them. In Crystal Springs, David Kenny, WLBT News. The Crystal Springs First Baptist Church was founded in 1883. To this day, a black couple has never been married there. The Wilsons are taking their talking, that is, with their attorneys and planning their next move.